Hey guys, happy Vlogmas day three, and I'm filming with my selfie stick. Wow, I never thought I would say that word in so long, so if it's a little shaky, I'm sorry. Um, I'm trying to get used to holding this. It's been so long since I filmed, but I'm next to my tree right over here. I kind of want to show you guys it now, but it's actually too dark, so maybe we should wait. Because this house is literally always pitch black dark. But yeah, the weather today is actually worse than yesterday. I mean, it's not that bad but it's not that great either i mean it's like gloomy rainyish type of weather um yeah not that great and my hair is so short since i've bleached it oh my god well i knew this was gonna happen i knew this was gonna happen when you bleach your hair your hair gets so short and it just gets ruined but this is the last time i'm gonna be bleaching it and having it blonde so we'll see how long it's gonna last but anyways um yeah so i'm just here i need to actually change into some other type of pants because i want to go outside and put some fresh water for the chickens and also you know give them some corn and all that stuff it's still a little early so maybe i'll wait for a little while but yeah i'm currently in my room i'm gonna put on these other pants that i have for outside um where are they oh somewhere i don't know where they are but yeah i guess we'll i'll get back with y'all when i'm outside so let me just get dressed guys, so for my lunch i'm just having a everything bagel with just some cream cheese in it and that's it did i say lunch i mean breakfast sorry my brain's not working and then i don't know what i'll have for lunch we'll see maybe i won't have anything i don't know but yeah i'm done with this whoops this is my favorite kind of bagel in case anyone is one right junior let's go baby go come on, come on, come on. okay you boys ready to go outside of course not this dog y'all you're gonna go outside look at me zeus don't give me those puppy eyes let's go outside outside <laughs> you're just so cute look at him you guys he's so spoiled but here is my um 55 looking good I have to grab my jacket. This is the jacket that you guys always see me with outside. It's just what we wear every single time we go in the backyard. Because it's a nice jacket. I mean, not nice, like, fancy or anything. But it keeps you nice and warm. And that's what we need for here in Washington. Because it gets pretty chilly here. So, yeah. Okay, so I put some fresh water for the chickens. Fresh water here. There. I'm probably going to get a second bucket to fill it up and put more there. In here. And fix the inside of their coop a little bit. So far, we've got is one egg. So, yeah. They're so cute. And the dogs opened the gate for their area over there. And now they're just walking around here. Of course. I took out this box from the chicken's coop because they don't need it no more. You see this troublemaker? And then the other one over there. I mean, it's fine for them to stay on this side it is closed off so technically it's fine but sometimes I worry about that gate so yeah oh junior what I was thinking I liked this water thing but it's dripping oh, fuck all right so I'm gonna put some water for the dogs area out here Gotta clean, pick up their dog poo as well. But this is where their water stuff is. Yeah, it's gross. Ah, those juicy worms. I don't know what those weird things are. Glass? Somebody chewed it? That's freaking weird. Who would chew that? I don't think my dogs would. That's freaking weird. Hmm. Get some fresh water for them. Junior! Look at them causing trouble over there. Eating grass like a couple of goats. So we're gonna go through here. And this is the room that's just holding a couple of more things um 
trying to see what this is. Is this a rocking chair? Yep. I think I have my succulents here, which don't seem to be looking that great. So I'm going to have to see if I can move these somewhere else after. Boys, what are you doing here? Oh, I love this thing over there, guys, because that thing over there makes some cool disco lights for Christmas. There's a Christmas box there. There's my bike. I need to take this out again sometime soon so I can go for a bike ride. Maybe I'll go later today with Zeus attached to it because I have the dog leash around it for this guy. Come on, let's go, Clifford. So this would be super nice bedroom if it was finished. Yeah. All my work outside is done. Chickens have fresh water. The dogs have fresh water outside as well. Um, now it's time to come inside and fill up the... Come on, come inside. Let's go, boys. Come inside and fill up these things that holds the dog food here. And then fill up the cat one as well. And tidy up in here. And then maybe I play some Sims or something today. I'm not entirely sure yet because I did get two new expansions on Black Friday. Um... I got, what, what did I get? <sighs> Brain dead. I got both uh, Sims 4 expansion packs, Get Famous, and then also got the other one, which was um, Island Living. So I got them basically because it has more worlds. Worlds, and I wanted, you know, the more worlds. Worlds, I uh, can't even fucking speak today, for them to experience. So, ooh, let me tidy up I for I to bit. show you guys our eggs here. These are the fresh eggs that we get from our chickens here. We get some white ones, we get some brown ones, some light colored cream ones, um, like somewhere around here. There used to be, I don't know, anymore, but, um, yeah. Then we have some also eggs from the grocery store stuffed away in there, but that's just when we didn't have that much eggs. They're not laying as much, I mean, we only have three that are young and the rest are kind of older hens, so I think they're kind of done laying for the most part, and a lot of them are actually molting, so that's why. We don't also get a lot of eggs, but I'm going to put this back in here. This is where I keep them for now because we do have a very small fridge. I'll show you guys it. Oops, something fell. I'll show you that. Oh, just a lemon thing. Okay. So we have just, this is our fridge. Very small. I wish it was the one that's divided in half so that you can have the whole top section for food. For like, you know, non-frozen stuff in the bottom for frozen things. And would make life much easier, but... We don't, oh, and up there is my water jug that I use to drink water. I should probably drink some water now. And this, this is our uh, freezer here. See, very fucking tiny. You cannot fit nothing in this horrendous fridge. It's a big one, guys. This is how much I drink from yesterday. Yum. So, yeah. I don't know. I mean, I think for lunch, I'm probably just going to have some noodles. I eat pretty much the same thing every day, guys, just because, I don't know. I just do. But, yeah, I guess I'll check in with you guys. So my next step is to clean my desk right now. There's a lot of things when I was doing makeup. And I just hate a cluttered room, a cluttered desk, everything. Especially, my desk is the one place that always gets very cluttered. All the time, because I do my makeup here, and I need to also clean this out a little bit. I do my makeup here, I, I'm on my computer here, this desk functions as everything for me. And it's just a little messy, so it's kind of stressing me out. So I'm going to have to clean this out real quick and organize it, and then over here, organize it as well. It's just a hot mess, guys. So get ready for an after video to see how it's organized, and... We've got Zeus hanging down here, we've got Junior over here, and we've got Osric up there. Osric! So, we're just going to organize this quickly. Again, it's a mess. I hate this. I wish I had, like, a separate desk for makeup and things, even though I'm not really... I don't do much makeup. Like, I mean, I don't have enough makeup for a makeup desk, but... Yeah. Definitely can see I store my makeup in here. I store some other things in here, like pencils mainly makeup stuff and whatever other things that i don't want to lose so yeah and i'm also watching dr seuss the grinch so little christmas movie while i decorate so i'll show you guys how the finished look outcome is once i finish organizing my whole desk area and maybe yeah, my room i want to show you my room real quick this is it i completely cleaned out my desk which is nice probably won't stay this way because i'm just not 
My desk is always the one place that is always cluttered. But there's my Christmas ornaments and trees and decorations up there. And then we've got my... Um, I love this desk, guys. I got it for a really good price from this woman who was selling it. I forgot how much I got it for. But I know that it was a good price. And I organized my drawer a little bit more nicely. Organized there, too. So it's not as messy. Threw a whole bunch of things in the garbage that need to stick out. There's my cat just hanging. Got my laundry basket here. This is what it's looking like. My cat's little box area that I made. He's, there's no way for him to step there, so I'm going to have to put some like blanket there or something. <laughs> Look at him, he's so cute. And then I've got my mom's foot thing over there for now. Um, I've got here my weight thing. I can't mm, think of the name right now. Um, weight scale, yes. And then my little bookshelf basket thing looking whatever it is. Little bookshelf. I love this because it has like, you know, my shirts up here. Pet stuff, fish stuff, skirts, and what's in here? Bras, I think. Sports bras. And my purse. And then I love my desk too because it has this other beautiful tank here that I still have yet to fill. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do with that. I'm still watching Dr. Seuss. Um, my dog's colors up here hanging. So I don't lose it or anything because that would be bad. Um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty much clean here. We've got these two just hanging. I hate a cluttered room. Saying, I hate a cluttered room. I don't know. I just cannot. I cannot. I hate cluttered places. It just, a messy room and a cluttered room just makes me, puts me in the ugh mood. And some people have very messy rooms and things. And I'm just like, how do you do that? I just cannot. I cannot like the only last thing for me here would be to sweep the floor up and then this room is done so yeah um also if my hair looks weird here a little bit it's because i did dye it but i didn't want to bleach the roots because i told you i'm not bleaching anymore i just added another blonde color to it same blonde color just to make it more fresh i guess i don't know to line it up again but um yeah so my next step will be to let's turn this off for a second my next step is to wash the dishes, vacuum, clean the living room, tidy the living room up a little bit. Luckily, our house is small, so it's kind of easy to maintain versus a bigger house. But, yeah. So, that's going to... I'm going to do that quickly. So, let me do that, and then I'll get back lunch, with you I just made some noodles. This is one pack of noodles. I got Family Guy playing here. So, And I did clean the house, so let me show you guys it so far. I fixed the couch blankets. Well, the reason why we have couch blankets, guys, is because this dog, he sits up here and he scratches. He scratched the couch there really badly underneath in there. So we keep him on because he sits up here. I want to start teaching him not to sit on the couch. Luckily, this one doesn't sit unless we invite him on the couch. Well-mannered boy. Wipe the um, table clean. Got the dog's toy here. I did clean the bathroom a little bit. Clean the table. Fix these chairs. Gotta push this one in. And then after I eat, I'm gonna finish washing my dish over there. And then I'm gonna clean the glass of this aquarium and then shower. And uh, then probably play some Sims. Or something. I still haven't played Sims. I'm watching the Grinch, guys. So cute. He's so sweet. <laughs> he reminds me of my dog. I can't do this. He's so cute. Thank you for inviting me. He's so sweet. Uh, I, I wore a tie. And it's, it's a very nice tie. Cindy Lou, look who came. Mr. Grinch, you're here. Hello. So cute. Come on in. Hello, Mr. Grinch. Merry Christmas. No. Merry Christmas to you, too. Aunt Ida, I'd like you to meet my friend, the Grinch. I love Mr. Grinch, guys. He doesn't really hate Christmas. It's just, you know, he is misunderstood. I feel like he's misunderstood and he just didn't have the best... Christmas experience growing up, but I've always loved The Grinch. Such a good movie, and this is also good too. Oh, it's nice to meet you. So Mr. cute. Grinch. Hey guys, so this is the aquarium right now. I just finished doing a water change on it, and that's why it's a little, little murky and cloudy and stuff. I also cleaned the glass off of algae, and I know the reason why I'm getting lots of algae is because of the light that I have up here. It's very powerful, and it 
provides, you know, a lot of algae. So what I need to do, I think, is either get some type of floating plants on top to kind of, that'll give coverage to the tank and, you know, not a lot of algae. So I think that's what I need to do. I do have a bristle nose pleco that I actually picked up um, a few days ago. I think I picked him up s uh, Sunday, I think, or Monday. No, Sunday, probably. But um, yeah, he's really tiny. He's not even an inch big. Super, super tiny. Look at these two cutie patooties. But uh, yeah, so um, this is it right now. I'm going to show you it once it clears up. But yeah, the pleco that I did get is super tiny. He just, I haven't seen him since I put him in here. I'm sure he's alive. It's just a little tiny baby. I heard that they're good with algae. So I do want to get some more like algae cleaning fish. It's just, I think I'm going to do some more research to see which ones are best. Because I do have these two that um, I was told they were good. But they don't really clean too much algae. I mean, they don't really do much. These two little striped guys, they hang out with that... Um, Neon black tetra neon or whatever. Um, I think I feel like they think they're one of them, but anyways, yeah. So I just did the water change on that, looking good, excited. So I have mixed some fresh food for the goldfish. These ones I have in the water, hopefully, soon when the weather is more sunny. Could have done it yesterday, but kind of busy yesterday so. More food for them to eat. I need to stop bringing the white food. It looks like they don't really like the white food over there. So just the brown flakes, I guess. We'll do that for them. Oh, for the chickens. They're right over here. This is why I love chickens, guys. They're always here to greet you. They're like dogs in a way. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Who are my beautiful ladies? Y'all ready for some corn? God, I sound so country. Y'all ready for some corn? Corn on the cob? Just kidding. Anyways. Yo, look at this. They're not even scared no more. Especially the black and white one. Her? No. Okay, I'm gonna spread some around for everybody to have some. Damn, they eat half of it. You are some hungry girls, huh? Okay, so this is where I usually do is put some here. Let me move this. So they don't injure themselves this way. I'm gonna put that out after. I'm gonna put some more here. Some here. Some up here. And then the rest will be here. I'm actually gonna keep some here so I can feed them as well. Any takers? No? Oh, bless you. <laughs> Look at my girl. You can have some. Don't be scared. I can't wait for these shrubs to grow. It would be nice to add some privacy to the backyard. <laughs> this one's molting like crazy, y'all. <laughs> Dang, you is wild. Hey, you be nice. Sir. Crazy. So everybody's eating here. Hi. She seems confused here. Alright, so there's places for everybody to eat. There's nothing here. Oh, you just pecked my hand. Crazy chicken. Look at them. So cute and pretty. I love my chickens. I love these guys to go out and pee or poo. Do what they gotta do. So this is basically the dog area here, guys. That's their kennel over there for when we're gone somewhere for like a longer trip, like if we're gone a few hours or something. This dog's up to no good. We added that fence in there because there's another dog on the other side and and sometimes they like to fight. Yeah. And this is where the other side for humans and such. Why is he acting like a wild animal? Hey, quit it. Be good.
Okay, now she put him in. He starts freaking out now. Come on, let's go, Junior. Come on. I just love coming to a clean room. Nothing beats a clean room. I think my cat's actually hiding in there. Yes, he is. Hi, Ozzy. Oh, cat. He jumped from here to there. Silly boy. And then here. Oh, my Ted load or Ted stool, whatever you guys call it. Leather. Leather toad, I think. Something like that. It's huge. Wow, look at this guy. He is all spread out. Looking awesome. And then my um, torch. Looking beautiful. I love this. I love this aquarium, guys. I will upgrade them one day to something bigger. Sorry, my back just cracked if you heard that. But it's just... I don't want to overwhelm myself, so I'm just going to take baby steps. And I do have 12 corals, again, like I've said, arriving. So if they can't all fit in here, I'm going to have to start getting this aquarium ready and set it all up. And I can also move them into here as well. So that's the reason I got this also was for... Ignore the mirror. It was for the salt water to make another one. But yeah, well, my cat decided to come out. Hi, beautiful cat. So, yeah, Look so Eric I just... Cook, my cat, come up. Oh, come on, I'll help you. Come here. Oh, good boy. You good boy. This lighting, guys, is really crazy. Especially when you try to film yourself. Gosh, look at this hair. Now that is freaking nuts. Say hi, Ozzy. He's so beautiful. That's it for today's vlogmas, guys. Nothing really interesting, but you already know. Not every single day is going to be interesting. But tomorrow should be interesting because I have my corals arriving tomorrow. And I think I have like, I think 12 white orders that are coming. So that'll be fun. I'll probably do a separate un unboxing video of those. And also include one into the vlog. I don't know because I also do want to show everybody it as I unbox them or something. Um, yeah, so that'll be a fun day tomorrow. More interesting for sure. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And let me know how you guys' this December is going so far. Also, my birthday is December 16th. So that's coming up. Um, I don't know if I'll be doing anything. I don't really do anything for my birthdays for the most part. I know, it's kind of sad. But whatever. Anyways, um, I'll see y'all in the next vlog. Thanks for watching. Bye.